There's somebody right there. Oh, Elmo. Yeah, we're definitely coming back for Elmo. This aisleway has been so hot recently. Wow, that, wow. That looks like a really good chair. Well, that was a beautiful chair, but the armrests completely rubbed off. So we pass on that, but we grabbed those books. Hopefully that's a nice little expensive set to sell. Hey guys, if you're new here, welcome. We have a lot of fun here. Smash that subscribe button down below and turn on your bell notifications so when fresh content comes out, you're the first to know. Well, of course, I took that beautiful, beautiful glass vase, another vacuum over there. Looks like a non-Dyson Shark or Shark. Uh, let's see here, it's down here. It's gonna be really dark. So what we're planning on doing with that is, I mean, <laughs> That's just too beautiful not to take. And then what you do is you get some fake flowers, you shove it in it like a big old vase. Let's go ahead and look this way. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Um, let's go ahead and go around the other side. Uh, that was a printer. Uh, might be worth some money and then something else. So let's roll around. Let's check this one first, nothing there. Let's roll around and see what we got over here on the printer. And then there was a black bag uh, right there. Let's see if anything is inside that one. Well, I typically don't grab every printer, especially the ink cartridges, because they just are such dime a dozen for different uh, styles. Some of them go for a lot, some of them don't go for much at all. And again, after shipping, we gotta think about that too. But Brother printers definitely sell for a lot of money, especially that MFC or something like that. Uh, that one might be laser color toner. Uh, I don't think so though. I think it is only black and white. Uh, but nonetheless, it said wireless on it, and I'm almost about 99% sure that is laser, meaning it does not take ink cartridges, which means it lasts a lot longer and worth a lot more money. Well, that was a really nice Cuisinart, I think, pizza oven or regular oven, but it was very nice nonetheless. And right before that, a Rolls Royce Phantom came around the corner. So uh, that's the kind and the clientele that do throw away some action. I don't know if it's gonna be this episode or last episode, um, but remember the yellow husky ladder with just a little bit of a bent first step? What are the odds that that ladder is still gonna be here. I'd say slim to absolutely none. That type of find is definitely something that if you're thinking about it, grab it. But we're coming around here just a little bit here, not this particular one, but let's go ahead and look here. Nothing here. All right, the next one is the ladder. Let's see if it's there. And we're approaching it. And don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. It helps the algorithm of YouTube so others can find my videos. And five, four, three, two, one. No ladder, boo. Okay, but hey, how about a thumbs up, baby? I'm crazy for not taking it. I just have nowhere to put it. Well, I mean, I could put it somewhere, but it just takes up so much room. I know what you're thinking. You're like, Chris, there's no way a Rolls Royce Phantom lives in an apartment complex. I've seen crazier. 
I've seen guys running a one bedroom apartment that own a Lamborghini that they park in the garage. Is that clothes or is that trash? Can't really tell. Oh, no, it's a protein jug. That's trash. But what if there was protein powder still in it? Good observation. Well, that was a lovely score. I don't know what's in that Nikon little uh, leather case, but some sort of attachments. I don't know if it's a camcorder. I don't know if it's like an actual just accessories for a digital point and shoot DSLR. We're gonna find out when I get back. That was a McLean juicer. McLean, whoa, 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 folks. Folks, here we go, folks. Folks, here we go, folks. Folks, here we go, folks. Okay, I think we gotta go back around. There's somebody right there. Oh, Elmo. Yeah, we're definitely coming back for Elmo. Sweet! I am slowly building up my exercise home gym with free weights. Insane! And I was able to grab the other ski pole. It was inside the trash can. I was able to grab that bad boy. And I actually need ski poles because I found skis without the ski poles. Now I got both. And if you were wondering, those were 20 pounds a piece, total of $40 weights. You could probably sell those Craigslist all day long. $1 a pound. That's $40 in weights and they're good condition too. Those are rubberized just like 24 hour fitness. Well, not like the round rubberized, but those are like something you would buy in Walmart where they're kind of like, what is that? A cube? No. Sphere? No. Equinox? No. Equilux? No. Equinox. Eggnog. That's eggnog. Well, the Nikon case turned out to be a case with accessories, but it's actually a really nice case. I believe that is full-blown leather. Little nice little pockets up here, and then it folds open to uh, maybe lenses, accessories. Uh, I think what it is, <clears throat> these are a lot of like, almost like, I don't know if they, yeah, I think they screw on. Maybe for some lenses, and then like a flash hood or something like that. Double little arm here. Uh, what else? Some weird stuff here. There's like two of those, like four of these. 
I don't need this, this is too big. I would never carry a digital SLR camera in this. So I'm gonna pile everything back in it and donate it. I have a big, big donation load I gotta do. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Look at my battery farm, it's getting real nice. And this, my friends, if you notice that, this is my product review section for my other channel, if you're not aware of it, new subscribers, Tips In In Tricks. It's always linked below, two ins, Tips In In Tricks. We've got a robotic vacuum we're gonna be reviewing. We got some color changing LED lights. We have a massage gun. We have another massage gun. This one should already be up on the channel. This is a great gun, budget price. They're marketing it for a great price to get into the massage gun. And those are those thumper guns for muscles. We got a 4K security system. Uh, and then we already have the Amcrest security camera 4K. Those are already up on the channel. And then we're working on another one down here. That's the tech review, house review, house project DIY. Those guys know what I'm talking about. That's where my electric battery build, electric trike build, electric bicycle build, that's gonna be on the other channel, tips in in tricks. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos, continue to watch, and we'll see you soon.